I didn't care for uh, Jared Leto in this. I don't know if you did either. <laughs> no, he overacts like some shit. I I almost thought like all his whole monologue was just him doing that on the spot. Like that wasn't even in script or in character. <laughs> And I, it yeah, wouldn't be um, surprised me if he ad libbed a little bit. Probably. I mean, he just overacts. Yeah. And his character was very interesting. I want to see him do a comedy. That would be a game changer for him. Yeah, he, I, he won an Academy Award, and now he thinks he's the shit. That's yeah. What it is. Yeah, he's still off that Joker high horse. <laughs> it's like Warner Brothers screwed me over. So yeah, one thing I did not like, I didn't like the whole replicant resistance uprising. That was so, like, uh, novel. It was so uh, YA novel. <laughs> yeah, so YA novel. And that I never felt like the replicants needed to have a revolution. I felt like all they ever wanted to do was just fit in. Yeah. Not like they ever wanted to take over the humans. I never would have predicted someone like Jared Leto would come out of this, like... Yeah, I don't like Rucker Howard's character makes so much sense. Like he wants to be accepted as a human, just through and through. Person, and that, I felt the same way with uh, Dave Bautista's character. Yeah. At the, um, he just wants to be a farmer. Yeah, exactly. And but then we have these just these new um, super powered, uh, intelligent life forms that want to own up, like want to own their uh, repl replicant label, and just I guess take over again. <laughs> I don't know. Which it just that seems like it just doesn't seem like the, the right direction. I hope they weren't trying to open it up for a sequel or something because I don't. Mm -hmm. I think I'm fine with just these two Blade Runner movies. Yeah. I don't, if they make a third one, it'll just cheapen it. I I'm gonna assume this one's probably gonna be it until maybe 30 years later. Hey, let's just make another one or something. But I'd be down with that. <laughs> but yeah, I hope this is pretty much it. Um, yeah. It doesn't. It doesn't like open up a, a universe really. I mean, it it attempts to in its own movie, but it doesn't say like, oh, get ready for the next film or something. You know, n nothing to prepare you for a, a spawn of sequels. Yeah, Nick Fury doesn't show up in this one. Yeah, th thank goodness. <laughs> but we did get we did get a Guardian of the Galaxy in this film. 